component and obviously it's a passive component. In electronic circuit, resistors are used to reduce current flow. It can also divide voltage. Look at this funny image. This image says everything about working principle of a resistor. Voltage pushing electrons. But resistor is trying to block the electron. In this way, resistor reduce current flow. Now, question is, when we use resistor? Okay, simply imagine, you have a 6 volt power source and a LED which is required 4 volt. In this case, you must need to use resistance to blow that LED. But how many resistance do you need? German physicist and mathematician George Simon Ohm answered this question by his legendary law known as Ohm's law. Let's explain this legendary law. I'm using a simulator named AV circuit. Okay, first we need a power source. So taking it, oh it's 1 volt. I'm just changing it to 6 volt. Now taking an LED. This LED required 2 volt and 20 milliampere. I'm changing it to 4 volt and 1 ampere. Now connecting this LED with 6 volt power source and also connect the ground. Oops. This LED just damaged. So need to use resistance. Time to apply Ohm's law. V equal to IR, it's Ohm's law. So R equal to V divided I. Okay, your source is 6 volt and LED required 4 volt. So you need to drain 2 volt and you also need 1 ampere current. Now set this value on Ohm's law. Easy equation and answer is 2. So you need 2 ohm resistance to glow that LED properly. Let's see. Take in a resistor. It's 1k ohm. So need to change this value to 2 ohm. Done. Now just connecting this resistance with LED. All done. I'm just playing it. See, LED is glowing perfectly. By using this law, you can find out unknown voltage and current. Anyway, that's all of this topic. See you on next video. Have a nice day.